Here we are with Maroon Less Kenny Story Part 7. This is where the last part left off, but it makes sense to show this scene again to see where the portal leads to. So, we watch Kenny as he. Well, I think it is a lot faster when he uh, tears down these weeds or branches with his hands than it is with a machete. Yeah, yeah, he goes through it. Because in the last episode, it didn't show it left off what, where it didn't. It doesn't show where the portal was going. It just ended with this scene and didn't show where the portal led to. So here we are. Uh, this shows where the portal went. It would make sense. First, he's going to go through some dig piles. I don't know if y'all enjoyed Zoe, my daughter, narrating or well, helping me narrate the last one, but she will again. Oh, it was her. It's her birthday, and she she's all tired out. I mean, she had two birthday parties in one day, one at the trampoline park, and another one a few hours later with the with family, and she is just tuckered out after opening all the presents. She just had a blast. She'll narrate the next one. She'll help me. Because I know she'll love it. And um, for now, I'll just narrate this one just to get it out of the way. Because I think some people do enjoy the Jungle Adventures pack. And I'm trying to enjoy it as well. I mean, there are some times I want to go through these portals and they're closed. And say, try coming back next vacation. <laughs> You know, sometimes I just don't have the patience for that. So I have, so I try to have Kenny go back home and then come back, and it still be closed. I'm like, you gotta be kidding me! But that's in later episodes. That's just spoiling too much. I mean, to uh, f the first time playing the Jungle Adventures was pretty exciting. I mean, I had to watch. How the Sims Supply did it with his character uh, exploring the jungle adventures. I had to see how he did it first, and then it gave me an idea. Maybe I should do the same thing, but with my character. I paused the game to look around. Because this is the first time playing this game, I gotta see. My surroundings. Oh, and I gotta warn you, the next episode is gonna be a lot longer than this one. It's gonna be about five minutes longer. I never did a 20 minute video. But hey, first time for everything. This one's a 15 minute video. And the reason I don't do 15 minute videos because the time it takes to upload. And it already takes about two hours to uh, finish producing the, the episode. Because it renders. It takes about a couple hours to do that. And then it takes probably another three to four hours to upload to YouTube. Probably because I got crappy bandwidth. If you know about Fairpoint Communications, then you know they suck. No matter what kind of router you get. So I have to deal with that. And now I'm not turning on mobile hotspots. The last time I did that, I ended up using 10 gigabytes of data in one day. And I'm not doing that again. And that was in December. And that was when we really needed that that data. When we were traveling for vacation. We needed that. But I screwed that up. Turning on the mobile hotspot. So I'm not doing that for data. I'm not doing that for Wi-Fi anymore. Anyways. Enough rambling about my personal life. 
unless you like hearing about my personal life. What do you think Kenny's going to find here? I'll wait till you see the next episode. There is one scene that is going to crack you up. (laughs) I can't stop thinking about it. I want to do something funny to make people laugh. I like making people laugh. It's just my thing. Throughout my life, people thought I was weird. (laughs) So what? I mean, weird is good. Yeah. I had no friends in grade school. Uh, I was bullied a lot. And it sucked. Which traumatized me to to the point where... I am socially awkward around people. People got to talk to me first. If I just... I have a history of walking up to people... And they just look at me weird... And talk about me behind my back. So... I don't like talking to people. I'll, I'll talk to people if they talk to me first. That's just how I am. I haven't gotten over it. How I have friends... And how I made a friend in middle school... and. And then through have a friend through high school, how I did that? Well, they approached me first. <laughs> this is how it worked. So, the idea of Maroon Lust, why it's titled this way, because in the writing, in the original story, um, Kenny has a daughter named Lucky, and... And it's her, um, well, her being socially awkward through high school. And her dealing with drama as a family life. All of that. And I don't know how to film a high school situation in Sims. I don't see how I can play characters that's not in the same household. Because I can't just sit there, play one character... And switch households to play with another character. Because then that character is not in the same position where I left them. They'll be somewhere else doing something else. I I can't keep track of that. I don't know how you do that. If you know a way that you can play a a character from a different household. I mean, like if you... Like say if um, you do a situation like in the get to work where... Like, you send a cop to the police station, whatever. Is there a way you could switch characters that's not in your household? So you could interact with them. I mean, use them to interact with your character. I mean, if there's a way to switch households, like, to have full control of that character. I mean, I gotta do that for Rune Lust to actually work in my... If I do do that in Sims. Like. I don't want this character to act. The way I don't want them to act. It's like. Like one of my characters get bullied. I mean. What if that situation don't end up like that. In, in, in Sims. I can't get my characters to act the way I want them to. If I did it through Sims. Just can't do it that way. Also. I think it's awesome to have uh, some of the characters in my in my story to have parents who also have a backstory who explain, oh, my father did this. When in reality, um, my in my story, Kenny didn't really go on any jungle adventures, but it would be not. It's a nice fantasy. It's a nice thought, like his. Like his daughter playing Sims, and have her dad say, "Hey, it would be cool if you if you if you did this with your life." He's like, "Yeah, sure, why not?" But Kenny was never an archaeologist. He never went on jungle adventures. He was a he was an attorney. <laughs> he was just a criminal defense attorney. He went to law school and all that. And his father never really kicked him out of the house. I mean, but. Hey, it doesn't hurt to do this a different way. Like, what if Kenny was exploring 
uh, the jungles of uh, El Salvador, you know. It doesn't hurt to think that way. Like, what if? Would his kids turn out differently? I mean, think about it. And who would he meet? Hmm. Who would he meet to have his children? I mean, you think after his jungle adventures, you think he should meet... You think he should find someone to settle down with? Would you rather him just keep doing explorations? Maybe with... There's this... I think there's this uh, hideaway or secret place in the uh, out, outdoor retreat. Maybe he should explore that. Because I haven't done that yet. I've never played with outdoor retreat yet. So I think I should. Um, what else? Uh, <laughs> I don't remember what else I was thinking. Like, should he explore more jungle? Should he explore outdoor retreat? Should he settle down? Should he explore his... Should he, should he explore his career as an attorney? Because I do have that mod. And lo- that... Where he goes... To, uh, takes a career in, in uh, law. There is that mod. I do have it. Which is nice. I like it. You know, I figure out how to get through these, um, through these booby traps, you know, from watching Sims fly. I think he's pretty awesome. His videos are awesome. I like why, seeing what he does, does for updates in Sims. My favorite, ah, oh, my favorite is the... Wags to riches. Oh, that's so cool. I get, and then he's the same character does the jungle adventures, and wow, that's awesome. I also like the one where um, uh, there was this one that was uh, doing the painting. The uh, lady big wallet uh, was doing all these paintings and stuff. That was cool. I also like his his renovations. Every time he builds a house. I'm like, wow, wish I could do that. I mean, I could build a house, but I suck at putting on a roof. I really do. I can't put on a roof for crap. I wish they brought back the part in Sims 3 where they had automatic roofing. (laughs) I need that because that's how I could build a house in Sims 3. The automatic roofing. I wish I had that in Sims 4. Because I suck at putting on a roof. I could try my best. I'm working on it. But it won't be as good as some of the builders I've seen playing Sims 4 and putting their videos on YouTube. I can't be as good as that. Who else was building houses better than me? The Ligracy. Yes. Um, there was another one. Was it Little Simsy? Jeez, uh, you could build. She could build a house better than me, and I'm like impressed. Wow, maybe I should download their houses and play them in my Sims game. I do build houses, but most of my houses are based on uh, houses I've lived in, or or I build houses. Like I go, I Google um, floor plans. So, <laughs> mostly for trailers because in Maroon Lust, I have a uh, a household that lives in a double wide trailer known as the Farleys. And these cute little na- character names my uh, daughter loves. It's like I told her I got a character named Peppermint and a character and a, and she has a sister named Sugar Cookie. It's like really those are cool names. <laughs> yeah. That will be another series of Murnust. I will add the Farleys. And one of them is Ray Farley. She is the mother of the Farley household. And she likes to own a bakery. I can do that in another series. After I finish the Kenny series. I can definitely do the Farley series. Maybe the Bennett series. Because there is a, a... 
Rafe already has a brother named uh, Kyle Bennett, and he has a daughter named Toba. I'll get to that later, but for now, I like to end this, and there will be another part, part eight, so stay tuned.